So this is what our uh, today's learning objective. That is, we will study what is distance and uh, what are the la, understand learning. Uh, what are, how we can measure the different ways of measuring distances. That is what we used to call as our uh, today's concept. Means we will study only today what is distance and how to measure the distance measurement. But before going to this, understand. So when we can come to know that, sir, what is this distance means? If you want to understand this distance very well and the law, how we need to measure them. So we need to know the story of transport. So first we will discuss that story. Is it okay, all of you? All of you first listen, drop everything. Understand, first listen carefully. Because story of transport, you should know awareness, that's all. So from once the concept will start, we will uh, follow from there. So let us start with the, as you know that, we have a multiple transportation systems now, for example, you can take. So, what is the present uh, transportation systems, Ra? For example, you tell me, what you know about the present transportation system? What kind of transportation systems you have now? Government, government bus transportation. Government. Government. Suppose you see, auto transportation is there. Bus transportation is there. Next, train transportation car. is there. Next. Car. 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 Yeah. Car. Next. Car. What? Airways. Airways. Okay, very good. So, aeroplane transportation is there. And also, Space. water transportation. Do you port, port, port transportation. Ship. Waterway. TV. 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 So, like TV. that. Present, we have these many transportations. So, we are all everything missionary. I understand. We are by using missions, we people used to transport. So, let us go to the back. The story of transport. And the, all of you, just you can remember. What is the meaning of transport means? To carry people and as well as goods from one place to another place is only called as, what we should call Ra? Transport. Transporting. What we should call? Transport. So, transport. is it only goods or is it only people? Is it only goods or is it only people? A good also, sir. Both. Good also for people also. The story of transport. So, let us discuss. What is the meaning of transport? I said, transport means what? It is the moving uh, one place to another place. Transporting the carry to carry people and goods from one place to another is called transport. You can write to carry to carry both not only the people are not only the goods both the, to carry people and and goods from from one place to another another is called what ra is called the transport you understanding all of you? So anything, suppose, understand. Suppose in our home itself, if you are, if you are carrying something from one room to another room, that is also called as transport only. Is it yes or no? Will you accept that or not? Everything, yes, everything sir. is called as transportation. Suppose I am keeping my pad, understanding, from one place to another place. That is also called as transportation. So anything, if you will transport, if you will, if you will shifting from, if you are moving any object or people from one place to another place, that is what we used to call as transport. Now, we will discuss how these people traveled and carried goods from one place to another in earlier times and how they do understand in present days. That is what we will study. So, how the people used to travel and carry the goods from one place to another in earlier times, earlier times and present how these days they are doing. So, let us go for example, long ago or else even 50 years or else 20 years before also it will go. The people did not have any means of transport. Is it yes or no? There is no particular type of transportation like bus transportation, car transportation, train transportation. Yeah, but there has been caught ox, bull. Yeah, very good. Now, yes, friend. He used to speak. Yeah, very good. If you'll go to the long back, understanding, long ago if you'll go, we have a one kind of transportation. There is no kind of, there is no special means of transport, understanding. So, in ancient time if you'll go, old, primitive ages, ancient time if you'll go, people used to move, understanding, on food or animals. Is it yes or no? You may observe here, olden days people used to travel, suppose if you want to go from Pudukote to Tanjore, how they will go up? I walk only, correct or not? Yes or no? Uh -huh. 
No, yes, surely, no. I'm not joking. No. Surely, hundreds of kilometer people used to go by walk because by that time only few fellows having animals like horse or some kind of uh, like bulls and all. So ordinary people and all, if they want to visit the Anasan Tanjo Temple, they will go by walk only from here. Yeah, I am saying like a thousand years before, like a Chola Raja, King the time of Chola Raja. Do you understand in Logan? Okay. So if you go to the ancient okay. times, means very long back ago, like thousand five hundred years, thousand years before, people used to move by foot, means by walk, or and animals they will go. And they will carry the goods also. They will carry the goods themselves, means on their shoulders they will carry, you may see, or they, on their head they will carry. Or they used understand animals for this purpose, like donkey. Do you know donkey? Donkey is the most domestic animal which we used to use from ancient time for carrying the goods. Is it yes or no? Is it yes or no? Yes, you maybe don't know. Yes, when I am a kid, like you people, understanding, people used to come to sell the salt and all, raw, understanding, a stone salt and all, people used to bring on donkeys only. Donkeys used to carry this uh, salt uh, uh, packets and all. So the people, uh, one fellow will follow it and they used to come and they used to sell that. But now everybody will come. Even you can see the beggars also having smartphone. Even so many fellows also used to come by smart, uh, very uh, sports bikes and all. Is it yes or no? Ordinary salesperson also used to come with a, a super cycle. As a, no cycle also. So, actually, bike only now. Everybody bike, correct. So that is what. But if you go to the ancient time, they used to use the understand. Either they can carry the goods by themselves, or else if it is heavy load, they used to carry understand by animals. For example, if you take ancient people used to travel on horsebacks and camel bucks. Is it yes or no? Still, if you go to the Saudi and all, people used to travel. Some villages people used to travel by using camel only. Understand? You may watch in some movies, correct? Still, if you go Rajasthan also, so many people used to travel from one village to another village and all by uh, camels or horses. Horses are very rare. But the camels are still using camel transportation. If you go to the Gulf, I think some of your parents also visited. So still, if you are going as a tourist for the Gulf countries, so so many because that is that is all deserts. So uh, cars and all cannot travel easily. So special cars only required. So that is why a simple transportation and a effective costless effective transportation, camel transportation they will use. But that is what the transportation we are using from ancient times. Understand, it is not the now. From our ancient people, they are using these horsebacks, or else camelbacks, etc., to travel, or else to carry the goods. Understand? And also, they will use these animals for carrying heavy goods. Understand? Like, for example, donkey. You, that is the most. How many of you know washerman? We have a special uh, washerman, correct or not? People used to wash every time, whole village, they will collect the wash and uh, cloths and they used to sell. Before, donkeys are most probably used by this washerman. They used to collect the full cloths from there, all the niggas, that all the area, and they will to dump on this donkey's uh, back. So the donkey will carry towards to the water body. So like heavy goods, if they want to transport, then by the time, there is no kind of understanding, like our present system. So everything by using animals only. Now, for example, let us say, how many of you know pyramids, Narayan, Sanat, anybody, service pyramids, do you know Egypt pyramid? Mummy, Egypt mummies. I know. Egypt pyramids, have you watched movies? Yeah, we have a movie yes, called yes. Mummy Returns, correct or not? Mummy Returns movie you may watch, correct? <laughs> Mr. Jansina used to eat uh, uh, scorpions directly. Scorpion King, you may watch in that. So Egypt movies, you may watch Egypt uh, pyramids and all. Uh, still, we don't have any idea how that much big stones has been carried uh, hundreds of feet above. But actually, we have a, some predictions that they used to pull that much big stones. Nowadays, we have a cranes and all. Eh, call the crane and just lift it and they, it will keep it there. But olden days, they used to use elephants or else horses or something to pull the big loads. Is it yes or no? Will you believe it? Will you believe it or not? No, sir. Don't know. Now, for example, you see, I will say the truth. You want to can search also. How many of you know Tanjo Temple? You all people know Tanjo Temple, correct? Yes, sir. Yes. So in that yes, Lord Shiva is there, Linga. We can call it as Linga. That Linga weight is 8 tons. Means it is the 
tallest linga in India. Tallest linga in India. You want to can search it. Actually, that is a single stone linga which has been directly they have been uh, sharpened. Understand? Uh, sculpture into Lord Linga. It has been carried from where you know during the Chola's time, thousand years before. From where? Will you expect anywhere? From where it is has been carried? Anybody? Any? Any idea? Please. What? Where? From? From where will expect? You are all people, Tamil Nadu people only, correct? You tell me. Suppose the stone is actually imported stone. It has been carried, understanding, from somewhere very far. So what? Where you will expect? Maximum you will expect where? Maybe Pudupodai? Or Kumbakona? Because it is nearer to the Tanjavur, so that we will expect the stone which has been brought from Pudupodai or Tanjavur, correct? Yes, sir. At this say yes. Yes, sir. It's a eight ton stone. By the time carrying with the yes, elephants will take minimum one month from Pudukote to Tanjore because it is sixty six kilometers. It will take minimum at least one uh, one month or even uh, two months also with the help of, uh, with the help of elephants. Actually, that stone is bought from not in Tanjore or uh, not in Tamil Nadu. It has been bought from Gujarat. Will you believe it? Thousand years before, imagine the stone has been brought from Gujarat Sabarmati River. You may heard uh, Gandhiji where he has been started the salt. Uh, what is that called as uh, revolution? Animal. Yes, yes. Animal. Yes, yes. So there, from there, actually, with the help of elephants only, that big stone has been carried to Tanjore. That is what we used to call as Lord Shiva, the largest uh, understanding uh, ideal of Lord Shiva in India is Tanjore one. Understanding, it has been bought from by that time itself. Imagine from Gujarat. Then how many kilometers? Ra? How many days it has been taken? Hundreds of days, years, correct or not? Definitely. Will you accept it or not? Yes, sir. Right? Log it. But it has been help of only yes, by elephants. Because elephants are very, very strong and very fatty and very tall. So they used to pull even heavy loads. So that is why ancient time people used to carry, understanding, any, any heavy goods and all. They will use this kind of animals like horses, camels, and like donkeys, and even more, even bigger load. They will use elephants to carry the load. Understand? But also, you may observe ancient times, people also used boats for transporting along water routes, uh, understanding, such as rivers. Is it yes or no? Is it yes or no? Will you accept it or yes, not? Sir. Yes? Yes, sir. Yeah. Because yeah. ancient time also our people used to hunt, like uh, fishing and all, they used to go. So by the time itself, we were now not. Understand, they used to use the boat to transport, that to travel the villages where there is no kind of road transport. But by the time, people are using only the boats where simple logs of wood in which uh, like a hollow cavity was made for people to sit and carry the boats. Like a small, small boats they used to make with the wood. Understand? So later on, people uh, uh, learn to join together a planks of wood and to make a boats having streamlined shapes. Streamlined shape means I have already told you, like a bird. Is it yes or no? Like something like a friend shape and all. Have you no boat? How it will be present? It will be front surface like this and back surface like this. Is it yes or no? Have you seen the boat anywhere it is square? Boat, anything where square, square shape? Okay. No. So, okay. initially people are using something, a small kind of blocks of wood to carry, understanding, and less people and as well as some kind of goods, very minimum goods. So later, they have started joining the big, understanding, blocks of wood and they are started making the boat into streamlined shapes. This kind of body is called as streamlined body. What we should call, Ra? Streamlined bodies. So you may observe any ship in the world, including from Titanic to present days, definitely the front surface will be like this and the back surface also will be like this. Will you have, have you seen or not? Tell yes, me. Sir. Yes. So this kind of yes, body, this kind of shape is only called as streamlined shape. All of you should remember. All of you should remember this is called as what? 
streamlined shape. So later they have been started joining. Understanding later they have been started joining a block support and they have been making a streamlined shape. So later only understanding we used to travel. Even they have started transporting the heavy goods and all. Do you understanding now? So till that time, till that time we don't have a name called as wheel. What is the meaning of wheel? Ra? So till before invention of wheel, we don't have any kind of wheel or any kind of uh, transportation. Even we don't have even bull cart also by that time because there is no wheel. Wheel is not invented by the time. So only one animal, they will sit on it, they will carry some load and they used to go now. So once the wheel has been invented, what is the meaning of wheel runner? Right? What is the meaning of wheel? Sanat, Santosh, wheel. Wheel is the wheel. What is the wheel? Which will make rotating character not. It looks like in a spherical shape, correct? Yes. So you will observe till before the invention of wheel understanding so we have a very difficulties with the transportation and all so later so before wheel we have only carrying directly or using some animals or else if it is water water we are using small small boats and all but later the invention of wheel made a great chance understanding and great change in the mode of transport so the wheels were used in making the transport vehicles such as bullock carts horse carts and camel carts etc etc and animals such as bullocks horses and camels were used to pull the vehicles which moved on wheels but the same trend nowadays recently also we are, we are observing in corona time are you observing in corona time some car some car setup they have been uh, attached to the bulls is it have you noticed it corona time because of pollution have you observed or not not observed celery do you want to see that if you want to see i will show you okay yes, sir. Uh, one minute yes, sir. Just, actually you may observe if you go to the time of invention of wheel, we have a different kind of instrument. There is no kind of car or anything by the time also. So they have been discovered the wheel. Sorry, they have been invented the wheel. So later, because of understanding, invention of wheel, we people used to make understanding, bull cards, horse cards, understanding, and camel cards, and as well as bicycle. Next time, after so many years, bicycle has been invented. After bicycle, motorcycle has been invented. Do you understand? So like that slowly now cars, trains and all etc etc. So once understanding they have been invented the wheel. So it has been brought the great changes in modes of transportation. Modes means different methods, modes of transportation. So that is what we can say, understanding, transportation. So that is what we can say, bull trans, bullock transportation or horse transportation, horse cart or camel cart, like this it will be. So now if you want to observe, still if you will go Rajasthan, these kind of understanding, transportation, we used to observe. And even if you will go Pakistan, now also I will say, if you will go to the Pakistan, understanding, still even they will use donkey transportation, donkey which has been attached to this, like, like this vehicle, like this vehicle the donkey has been attached and they used to use don donkey transportation yet even this is modern times also Pakistan is used to use donkey transportation because it is the cheapest one and they are even backward areas understanding still undeveloped country so that is why the people are so many are still using this kind of understanding even uh, old ancient times understand transportation systems only. Now, I will show you the modern car, modern bull cart. Understand, you people may be feel happy also. So that is what, yes or no? Bullock, bullocks and horse, horse cart and camel cart and all, we are using in ancient time. But now again, because of pollution and all, we people again started doing that. In even some areas, people are using further transportation. Let us show you how it is attached. You will feel funny. Enjoy. So observe very carefully. By seeing this picture, what are you thinking? Is it a car or not? Observe this one. Is it a car or not? <laughs> Tell me, Ra. Is it a car? Please let me know. Is it a car? No, sir. No. Yes, sir. 
because of increasing petrol prices and yeah. something something and all and also eco friendly somebody has designed this car how it is you see and you may observe also carefully it has been called as modern bullock car you can see bullock car is a understanding they have mentioned a 2021 budget car they are saying means without fear it will go how it is sir you see You can remember the old times. Modern bullock. Do you understand? They want to keep it again. You see. ಅಟ್ಯಾಚ್ಡ್ So that is what we should call as modern bullock, but it is actually ancient time we people are using. So now, later once this wheels are came, understanding. So we used to attach these wheels for the bull carts, bullock carts, horse carts, and as well as camel carts, etc. So animals are we are using like uh, understanding horses, bullocks, and camels were used to pull these vehicles. So which will uh, move uh, move on wheels. So later. the invention of wheel also led to the development of bicycle as a popular mode of transportation still in tamil nadu before when i came to tamil nadu i don't know this many people are using still bicycle but still in tamil nadu so many people are depend on bicycle transportation is it yes or no will you believe it or not even still some uh, milk people yeah milkman understanding milkman people are coming by bicycle only still i am observing understand so that is what so a biggest revolution in transportation by the time the most popular popular mode of transportation is bicycle transportation understand ra but later you can see in the beginning of 19th century just it is like our grandfather's time before our grandfather's time means during a uh, british time 1900 and means 1800 to 1900 19th century the invention of steam engine introduced a uh, new source of power run transport vehicle do you know that steam engines which will run with the coal are uh, you know it or not trains la do you understand yes sir yeah trains yes, sir. Been brought understanding trains has been invented which will run with the power power means electricity understanding means electricity not by that time it is run with the burning of coal or some kind of metal so that is what has been invented beginning of the 19th century later these steam engines understand they used to pull these trains understanding by burning of coal as a fuel for making producing steam means water we can evaporate with the help of understanding by burning coal so this is only will give will give the energy to run the trains that is what how the steam engines will run steam steam means what water vapor what is steam ra what is steam steam means what water vapor vapor means the trains which will run with the water vapor is called as steam so that has been first invention in during 19th century so by burning coal they will use as a coal as a fuel for producing steam so it will be used to produce the it will used to produce the steam so that the train will run understand so 
these steam engines were also used in even running ships in the beginning understand you may see titanic is also used to run with the burning of coal only do you want to see the shall i show you that even the big ship in that time they used to run by burning of coal they used to produce the steam with that steam only it is used to run do you want to show that if you want i will show you if not you don't know.